In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use the AI vocal remover. So if you have an audio file that has you speaking and you might have some music in the background, this is going to allow you to separate the two. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so I'm going to be showing you how to do this from start. So let's go ahead and record a voiceover here. So I'll go ahead and click uh, record, hit voiceover, and uh, you know you have your, um, let's go ahead and select this over here. A microphone if you have multiple you're going to be able to do that here select uh, the microphone you want to use and you also have we're going to go ahead and select input and go ahead and start okay want to start this it's going to do a countdown since we have this set to three so this is going to be the audio recording for this video and uh, yeah we're going to record for a few minutes and we're going to add music to this and we're going to try out the ai vocal remover so let's go ahead and stop this at 11 seconds all right cool now we have our audio file here. Let's go ahead and play this. So this is going to be the audio recording for this video. And uh, yeah, we're going to record for a few minutes and we're going to add music to this. And we're going to try out the... All right, cool. Now I'm going to go ahead and add some music to this. I have some uh, copyright free music saved over here, or we could use uh, the... Uh, the AI music generator. I do have a video on that if you want to try that out. But for now, let's go ahead and grab one of these songs here. All right, let's grab this one. I'll just drop it on here. All right, cool. Let me go ahead and trim it to where there's actual sound. I'll delete that. And I'll just make these two match here, okay? So I'll go ahead and delete that. All right, and I'll make this, let's make this a little lower, the volume itself. And I'll play this so you guys can hear how it sounds. So this is going to be the audio recording for this video. And so you can hear both the uh, my audio file as well as uh, the music that I just added. I'm going to go ahead and export this. And I will export this onto my desktop. And I'll call this just, and I'm going to change this over to MP3 since I only have audio. So like that. And there's some settings here. If you want to change up some settings, I'm just going to go ahead and click export. This should not take too long. As you can see, it's completed. I'm going to open the folder where it's saved and I'll just click drag and drop this into my uh, timeline here on my uh, media uh, section here. So now we have our audio file here. I'm going to go ahead and delete what we have on the timeline. I'm going to add this on the timeline. Let's make this a little bigger so you guys can see here. Okay. Play this. And, uh, yeah, we're going to record for a few minutes. And all right, cool. So now we're going to try out the AI audio remover. I'm going to go ahead and right click on the video and I'm going to go over to AI vocal remover. So click on that and it's going to start working, right? It might take long depending on the video. Um, so this is not taking too long since this is just a pretty short video. This has finished separating the two audio files. So I'm going to go ahead and delete the main audio file here. Go ahead and delete that. And I'm going to separate these two so we can compare. So this first one here is going to be the background audio, right? It labels it as the background audio. I'm going to go ahead and play this. So that was the music itself that I added into the background. And now we have our voice that we recorded. I'll play this. This is going to be the audio recording for this video. And uh, yeah, we're going to record for a few minutes. As you can see, this is not fully perfect, right? Uh, but it did separate the two, really. But it's not perfect. You might want to edit the audio a little more. If you double click on this, you're going to have all these settings here. So that is pretty much it when it comes to how you can use the AI vocal remover. It does a pretty good job. The audio is not always going to be perfect since you are stripping audio from a background noise or uh you know sound or music it's not always going to be perfect but uh, that is pretty much it for this video thank you so much for watching make sure to go and hit the subscribe button below if it's already and i'll see you guys on the next one peace